Hey guys, it's Bodie with IPTVWire.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install Proton VPN on any Amazon Fire Stick or Fire TV device. In addition to installing Proton VPN, I'm going to show you some of the settings and setup guides and servers that you can do with the free version of Proton VPN. Now, Proton is one of the most popular VPNs currently available, and I am using the free plan in this example. But guys, I suggest you stick around as I'm going to give you a better VPN alternative to Proton VPN. So to install Proton VPN on our Amazon Fire Stick, what we need to do is install the application from the Amazon App Store. So to do that, I'm gonna scroll over the find option here, then click search, and then I'm going to search Proton. And when I search Proton, you should see it pop up down here. I'm gonna click Proton VPN, and right here is Proton VPN. I'm gonna go ahead and click Proton VPN. And once I do that, go ahead and click download once you're on the download page. You're going to have to wait a few seconds for Proton VPN to download on your Fire Stick. All right, after Proton VPN has downloaded on your Fire Stick, I'm going to click the home button and I'm going to scroll over and click this apps icon next to the settings icon here. Make sure you click this apps icon. And as you scroll down on your apps and channels list, you should see Proton VPN now there. I'm gonna click the options button on my remote and I'm gonna click move to front. So now Proton VPN is towards the front of my apps and channels list. I'm gonna click the home button on my remote and you'll see it right here again towards the front of my apps list on my Fire Stick. I'm gonna go ahead and launch the Proton VPN app on my Fire Stick. And you'll see here it's gonna prompt me to sign in. So you can do this if you do not have an account, it is 100% free to create. At the bottom here, it says protonvpn.com forward slash sign up. I do have an account and I'm going to click sign in. So here it's gonna give me a code and guys, I'm gonna go ahead and sign in and then I'm gonna fast forward after I am logged into Proton VPN on my Fire Stick. All right, so after I have verified the code on my Proton VPN account, Right towards the top, the first thing I notice is it says you are not connected and it shows my actual IP address right under the warning message. So the first thing I like to do when going to any VPN is you'll see an option that says quick connect. Now this is in the Netherlands here and I wanna connect to a US server. So if I scroll down, you'll see all the different options for servers. Some have the lock icon and some say free. So I'm gonna connect to the free United States server. So it's gonna say connect or stream with plus, just click connect and you're like any VPN, you're gonna get a connection request. So make sure you click okay. And now it is connecting to the free United States VPN server that Proton VPN offers. And now towards the top, as you'll see, it says connected to United States and I have an anonymous IP address. So the first thing to call out that you may be wondering is why does some servers have these lock icons and why do some say free? Well, I am on the free version of Proton VPN. So in order to get these locked you know, servers from around the world, you would need to be subscribed to the paid plan of Proton VPN. So with the free plan, you get Japan, United States, and the Netherlands, it looks like, are the only three servers that you get for free. Now, if I scroll down here, you'll see there are a few settings where it says sign out, report an issue. But guys, that's what I wanted to show you is with Proton VPN. While it is decent for a free VPN, there is so little options here and you only have access to three servers, no customizations, no settings, and nothing else. And guys, one other thing I wanna call out is that if you are unfamiliar, free VPNs do sell your data to third parties. That is how they are able to make money. Unless you are subscribed to a VPN service like Surfshark, Nord, Express, IP Vanish, and some of the popular paid ones, that is how they make their money. But the free VPNs that don't charge, they sell your data to third parties. So be very cautious of using free VPNs like Proton VPN. And that is the reason why we recommend Surfshark VPN instead of Proton VPN or any free VPN for that matter. So as I click Quick Connect, 
Surfshark is my number one recommended VPN provider. And guys, I do have a special discount link you can find below this video that does help support myself and this channel. And a few reasons why I would suggest you use Surfshark instead of Proton VPN. Number one, all the different customization options with servers. You'll see I get access to hundreds of different servers. Uh, the Firestick application in general is a lot better, better navigation, better UX. And also the features. Surfshark VPN offers what's called a clean web feature where it blocks ads, trackers, and malware on various websites. And if I click settings, Surfshark VPN also offers a working kill switch on Fire TV sticks and also Android TV devices. This is a feature that many VPNs do not offer. Surfshark VPN also offers the WireGuard protocol. Where Proton VPN, I honestly don't even know what protocol we're on because you don't have the option to check that out on the free version. But Surfshark offers WireGuard and all of these different VPN protocols. But regardless, guys, that's it. That is how you install Proton VPN on any Amazon Fire Stick or Fire TV device. Again, this is Bodie with IPTV Wire. Appreciate you all watching this video. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment below. I hope this tutorial helped you out. And guys, I look forward to creating more content like this in the near future.